this real quick. Because I want to talk to the people real quick. You see, when I say, how did, can they talk about some border when they are the invaders? And how did, can they reform immigration when they invaded their neighbor? You see, these lyrics are for young people today as well. Look, if you're an older person like me, maybe you've been down since 86 out of this month. There's only a few of us in here, I know. But those of us that are in here, you already know what the mission is. It's our young people that don't really know. They see an all type of bullshit on TV. And if the elders don't tell them, your culture is the only culture you should be focused on. Your ancestry is the only ancestry you should be focused on. All that bullshit on TV should only be telling you to get smarter, get wiser, get richer, get healthier. You know they tried to tell us that bullshit in the 1960s. They said Malcolm X was full of shit. Fucking Dr. King was nobody. Mecca Evans wasn't shit. That double ACP. Now look, we stomped the shit out of the United States government. Take a listen. One culture can teach another. Just like people can teach people. Wisdom is not about going through hard times. It's about watching other people go through hard times and learning from their mistakes. They tried to tell us in 1973 that hip hop was bullshit. Every other day, it was, oh, that shit is just a fad. It's gonna go away in three more years. 45 years later, What I'm trying to say is that your mind is the only tool you have. Me, I dropped out of junior high school. Now I teach in Harvard. Go figure that shit out. I'm trying to talk to my young people, but when I talk to you, if I give you the truth, you gotta have the maturity to take it in. Fuck school. Mm -hmm. I got a message to give you tonight. I know a lot of people ain't gonna like it, but the fucking truth is the truth. You wasting your time in these public schools. I don't know if anybody's gonna tell you, but let me tell you from someone who has a PhD. Giving your mind over to a colonial system is a waste of your fucking time. You can't get a master's degree and not be a slave. When you get to your graduation and they give you your receipt, I mean your degree, then you'll understand. Oh, they're not hearing me. Turn that shit off. Track two, I want to freestyle this shit. Turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. Trying to get me? Switch the scene, you know what it means. 
if Richard Branson dropped out at just 16. I pull up out of key a week, fuck school. Two, three G's a week, fuck school. Entrepreneur for sure, fuck school. Taking more sweat, forget it, I'm cool. Dude switch teams for the money, son. Like Larry Page and Google, he dropped out at 21. What I'm trying to say, I'm trying to convey. It's just cause you dropped out, don't mean you threw your life away. Seek a new tactic, become autodidactic. Seek knowledge and success is automatic. <laughs> Microphones are grabbing. What's your habit? What's your talent? It's time to get at it. Grab it. It's like that, kid. You can drop out, pursue your dream, then go back like Shaq did. <laughs> With real talent, you never locked out. Just look at Magic Johnson. He too had to drop out. For too long we've been psyched out. Thinking that without a formal education we ain't going the right route. We gotta stop doubt and educate ourselves. Malcolm Little became Malcolm X in a jail cell. I pull him out of G and we fuck school. Oh y'all ready for that shit? See, when the truth comes, this is how it's gonna come. You might not like what you're hearing, but you cannot deny that it's the truth. And the truth comes to your heart. If you're doing good in school, stay in fucking school. Your mind can deal with that shit. But if you ain't doing so good, if you like, yo, this shit is bullshit. Yo, let me tell you, in 1978, I was about 12 years old. That's when I said fuck school. And I went to the Brooklyn Public Library and I educated myself. <laughs> fuck paying these tuitions at these bullshit colleges. Go to the public library. You got a PhD education in there for free. When I was growing up, the library was corny as hell. But it had books. And we would read the shit out of them books and have a conversation, be able to speak to anybody on any level because we were reading our way to the top. Knowledge is not in school. Knowledge is about your character. About your character. About your character. This is the message I'm sending to all people. Don't be afraid to drop out of school. Don't look down on yourself. I don't know, a lot of people were shocked. They said, KRS, what college did you come from? I'm like, what? I wrote five books already. Two of them taught in all the universities in America. I didn't see high school. Yes! 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 yes. I'm not telling you this to brag. I'm telling you the truth. When you believe in yourself, and you believe in your ability to succeed. There's no force on earth that's going to stop you. Know your purpose. Know your purpose. Know your purpose. Give me that music.
you this. Yo, when I'm in a memorable situation, I write my name on some tennis balls and I throw them out. On eBay, these shits is getting up there three, four hundred dollars for one of these. But I want you to get it as a remembrance that you are the greatest gift that you have. Your mind is the greatest jewel you can ever possess. Rise up, wake up. Music.